Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cow playing Mega Man Powered Up Online Levels, and we're right back at the, the Dengeki, going right here. Oh boy, Dengeki PlayStation visits Mega Man Powered Up once again. I feel like a lot of the titles kind of repeat themselves. The second Dengeki PlayStation Challenge. Description. You might call this an Amidakuji. I don't know what that is. Whether you succeed or fail is luck. Well, not quite. That's a lie! It's all skill! You'll need to use your split-second decision-making skills to break blocks in your way and clear a path to the boss. That sounds scary. I press the wrong button. Because <laughs> when you start a game, it's it's circle, but then here circle becomes back. Guts man. And it's Guts man. He's having a truckle. I got it covered. He's got it covered though, so don't worry about it. All right. Oh, yeah, we got we got bombs. Oh, we got we got everything though, so that's fun. But wait, so really? Like you got holes everywhere that you can do. Is there like any hints at all about where I want to go? Like you got to be squidding me. All right, well I'm somewhere. Maybe okay, so maybe it's more like a maze. You pick a path and oh boy, uh, firestorm. No, 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 no. Press the button first. Okay, well, I'm somewhere now, and I set Mutual on fire, as you do. Uh, okay, I can, I can, I can, I can live with all this. All right, I got an attack that goes straight up. It's called the Thunder Beam. Got something good? Hey, one up is pretty good indeed. All right, so here, be careful. And here I got pushed by the block. You just barely have any time. This is very strong. Okay, well, let's test something out then. Let's blow up this block. Like, let's... It's not gonna do. Let's blow up this block. Now it's gonna do. This just does nothing. Okay, this is just very, very dumb. All right, where are we gonna fall? Some... Like, do I want to go to the side there? I mean, I can. Firestorm. Hey, okay, let's check it out at the very least. Like, I feel a little bit more confident in exploring about if I do kind of move around a little bit, but like, there it's a spike, there there's not, so... Alright, so I guess we're gonna use the eye slasher and press the button. Gotta press the button first, you don't just unpause. Let's go here! Walking bomb! It has little Mickey Mouse feet. Alright, uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh, shoot, all right. Well, I say shoot, but I didn't make it. Ah! You just fell. Oh, shoot. Uh, okay. Uh, firestorm, I'm out. What other, oh, or bomb? I don't know if I have enough time. Well, let's find out. Oh, I do. Okay. All right, we're somewhere, I guess. Little feeties. Ooh, midpoint. That's scary. Wait, do I have a slide? Does not know, but there's a tiny little thing. But yeah, I can't slide. All right, I I don't like this. In most Mega Man games, you just on pause, right? And you have the weapon you have on, but this does not work in this game. You have to actually press attack, and then he'll let you. And I, I I'm not a fan of that. And I'm out of fire. I'm kind of wasted it. I guess because there's a bomb here, this might. I got the life. Of Oh, shoot. Um... And I did not know this was in my future, so yeah, I was too late. Because I could not predict that, that was going to be what was awaiting me. Okay, so... Uh, uh, uh. There we go. Just kind of muddle on through. Alright, so get your eye slasher ready. Make yourself blue. Fall in. Yeah, well, well, that's really cool, though. Like, that is genuinely pretty neat. I just wish there was a way to be able to anticipate it a little bit more, but, like, I'll take it. No, 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 no. If I shoot it now, it'll just come back. So, do a little bit of... Well, now it's gonna come back again. And I might get pushed off the ceiling. That is precisely what happened. Uh, really? All right, gonna start over now.
don't know. Ultimately, I decided that going straight down here was okay. I think I used the bomb pad. Well, I can go here. This is completely different. I can get a mid point here. Where's this gonna lead me? I don't know! Oh, wow. So... That's a path you can take that is so much faster. Why? Oh, because I got this in my hands. All right, fair enough. You know what? Let it, let, let's see what's going on here. Last time I... Okay, so I missed out on big health. Cool. Uh, yeah, I would rather... Like, I know I got LNR switching, but because there's, like, just spikes and death and just general unpleasantness everywhere around you here... I just feel like having the ability to stop time, just kind of stop everything, is extremely valuable in this environment. Alright, so this time I made it here. So next time I'm there is when I really need to do my jump. Like, here. Okay, well I did that. There's Big Eye. He's big, he's got an eye. Okay, that's not where we're going. Well, maybe I can, I can go there. Uh, if you freeze the thing, and then... Because, yeah, like, it's a pit underneath me. I know that, so, okay, I need to do that. Need to do... Press a button and not just on pause. So you do that, do that, uh-uh, uh-uh. Okay, and then fall in the pit. Just fall in the pit. That's what we do now. How simple would it be if I did this and then I did that? Can I not stop it? Like, I was trying to remove it, but I think this is worth trying at least once more. Where is it? Oil slider. Like, what if I go real- Whoa! Ugh. That, alright, control zone makes sense, it's fine. Alright, so we're here. This, this jump is very uncomfortable. And I didn't do it well. Alright, going down here. Uh, okay, so here I can slowly find this thing and go to this side, and I just end up here where there's nothing. Like, I saw there was, like, something... Oh, wait a second! So those things where it stopped, maybe I could just press down and go down a ladder. Maybe that's the mistake I'm doing. I guess I can handle this way. And thusly, I can... Uh, not get bought by that spike. And this will lead me to a uh, fresh, new, exciting... Terrible seeming place. How am I going to ever get this done? A mystery for everyone. Oh, okay, whatever. Yeah, you can press down. Alright, well, maybe there's good prizes? Nothing and nothing. That's the best kind of prize. It's over here. Huh, well, I'll take the heart. Dude, oh, pick! Pick up! Pick- Oh, I was bomb. I, I thought I- Okay. This one is just a pit. And doesn't seem to lead to much. get like uh walled in here. Got one. Right on 
kill you there. Da -da, rolling shutter. Do I remember how I died? Uh, I just fell in that, I think, in a dumb way. Alright, okay, so. I got a life, which is really nice. Guts man, his weakness is time, because he's the foreman and he has a time budget, and ain't got time to mess around with these blocks, so you just kind of stop time and he falls over. It's really weird. He's got the guts, and I don't got a gun. It's very strange. Ooh, but you can do that. You stop time and then you switch. Okay, okay, okay. We can... Do I have any ammo left? No, I don't. So you get two blasts of time slow. No more. Time is a very valuable resource. Whoa. Yeah, you're there. You just scream super arm. No one knows why. Alright, hit me with your feet, which might hurt less than your massive square block. Guts! That's right, he loves Nickelodeon. That's his prime personality. Alright, and uh, you got guts and they're all over the floor. Except they're robot guts, so it's not nearly as violent as I made it sound. Well, this level certainly was a mess, but it was unique. It was doing something a little bit different. I wouldn't... I feel like, honestly, if you put most of the setups and put them in a more, like, linear fashion, I might actually like it more. Because, I don't know, like, the fact that everything just kind of spaghettied everywhere is just kind of, like, it's a bit ugly in terms of level making. Like, I don't want to judge on, on, on that level, but it's just, it's kind of the only thing that keeps my mind. What does Amirakuji means? Well, you can call it that way.